not too long ago, in a place called the Internet, a show was released by the name of Ruby. And it pretty much opened up a whole new world to us. The world of Remnant, you know, all the, you know, all the characters within, all the, wor- all the different countries and worlds. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And from this have spawned, well, of course there's fanfic. I mean, honestly, Rule 34 of the internet. Uh, fi- if there is anything on the internet, there is guaranteed to be fanfic of it. Well, okay, um, that's not Rule 34. I started to say Rule 34 is No, too- I know. I, yeah, I, I, Rule 34 is the other thing, Nate. Uh, they know what it means. I'm just trying to keep this PG to some degree. Okay, sure. Whatever. All right. Um, so, but I mean, the thing is, there's a lot of room for that. Yes, there because is. Because there's so much of the world we haven't seen. There's so many people living in this world. Oh, okay. Sorry. I, I thought you meant like there's so much room for Rule 34. I was like, wait, what? what? No, no, no. Get off Rule 34, man. You're, Sorry I mentioned it. Jeez. Uh, okay. Anyway. You're the one that mentioned the tentacle. Now. Shut up! Oh, boy. Okay. Right. So, Dang, continue with intro. I'm okay, gonna... so, anyway, before we have any more interruptions... That you brought upon yourself. Look, I've already mentioned my Sub-Zero Elsa yeah, fan I'm fiction. sorry. Mike, I know! <laughs> okay, anyway, fan-made trailers. Fan-made trailers. I've seen a few of them for video games. I've seen a few of them for movies. I've seen a few of them for, for fan, uh, you know, for uh, fan service, cro- uh, you know, cross-play and all that. Anyway... People have been doing this with Ruby. Which uh, they've is been really crea- cool. They've been creating their own teams. They've been creating their own uh, characters and everything. Which, which is really neat because the, the Ruby trailers sort of introducing us to the different characters was pretty sweet. Yes. And, well, there is uh, one video in particular. Well, uh, there's, there's three one, of them. Three of them right you know. now. Uh, made by a channel called Mark. That's, Mark that's Zhang. That's it. Is Mark Zhang the dude. is the guy who does it. Yep. And... Uh, uh, currently, uh, currently ha- only has 17,000 subscribers. I'm surprised by this. Yeah. Uh, cause check him out guys. As many requests as we've gotten to do these. Mm-hmm. I mean, there's gotta be some, something crazy good here. Yeah. I mean, you're going to have to check it. You're going to have to check it out. I mean, yeah. uh, you're, you I mean, after we, I'm, I'm getting the fact feeling that when we watch this, it's going to be awesome. Oh yeah. So anyway, but. All right, this so. is the fan-made trailer called Charcoal by Mark Jang. Here we go. All right. Hmm. All right. Very similar to how Monty a, would start it. It's a similar feel. <clears throat> Not cabbages? No, no, those are army men. Those might be bad dudes. <clears throat> The mean dudemans. I told you don't touch that darn thing. All right. Oh, green ninjas. Green ninja? <laughs> All right. Well. All right. <laughs> Good. Ooh. <laughs> oh. All right. Right, that's pretty Broken sweet. All right. I like that. Run away. Yep. What's in the box? Uh oh. Oh boy. Look at this guy. Is that Yoshimatsu? Look at these guys. Oh. Oh. Hello. Uh, they're way less interesting now, actually. Why is that? Because there's so many of them. That's right. Uh, okay, I see what you mean. Like, as single dude, that's crazy cool. Multiple dudes? As multiple dudes, like, alright. Whoa, I like that. Sick. There's less of them now, Ben. Uh, Yeah. (laughs) They're getting cooler. 
They're robots, too. That's awesome. At least I hope they're robots. I just flashed back to they, the old Ninja Turtle are. cartoon. Well, say what? The old Ninja Tur Turtle cartoon. <laughs> Clang? Oh, yeah. Did you say Clang? These guys are robots. <laughs> Good chump. Decapitation! Nothing to lose your head over, guys. Oh! It just made out of superheated Saturnite. There you go. I got you some weapon schematics. That dang toaster. Oh. If I got to calibrate his sword, someone call Garrett. <laughs> Set up like bowling pins. Knock him down, John. And... Oh, oh that's cool. Nice. Instead of the standard, like, the sheath, he reloads. That's awesome. That's super good. Me likes. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Cool. So he's turned to Ash. Yep. I guess that's kind of his his mo. Probably. Yep. That would be modus operandi, not his weapon, magnum opus. Yep. Okay. Is it's it a, just it's me, a, or does it's that kind of look like a dolphin? I start. I was gonna say dolphin plane. All right. Hop on. Huh. Or hop so in. he's some sort of mission beefman. accomplished. We don't know. Maybe they stole maybe that from him. Maybe he's a reclaimer. He's a repo guy. Yep. Oh, he's got... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold he, on now. He's got broskies. He's got Templars. Damn. Okay. All right. So... That's fascinating. All right. My thing... My thing about that is... I liked his weapon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, weapon was cool. He sort of had like the it's got the kukri style. I don't know blade. Yeah, I don't know how what you how to put your finger on it, but it's like it has that ruby feel. Like because his style, um, because he's got his own fighting style. He's got his own like kind of slick way of dressing. He's got like yep. a combo weapon. You know, yeah. kind of how yeah. like your your yeah, he's, he's got the thematic color, but it's not the only thing that's going on. Yeah. Um. But he's it's definitely they, they it's really well thought out to have yeah. that like the unique character uh, heavy hitter vibe that you know they run with in Ruby and that's that's not necessarily the easiest thing in the world to do mm -mm. no so it's pretty impressive yeah I I've had my own ideas for for different teams and everything mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. I even imagined us and like personas and those yeah 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 I, I told you about the one mm -hmm. uh, which team Micah yep. <laughs> Which is uh, pretty great. Yeah, and uh, I was I was pretty happy with the characters I came up with. That I I came up with like uh, each character, their last name was based upon like a like a deity of a different of a different uh, of a different um, people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. like um, I think uh, the one character, the M Marlo, or which is a play on Merlot, you know, a type of red. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, his last name was Manuk, which is a uh, play on Nanuk. Uh, which is uh, the bear, which is a bear god in some Native American religions, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and then uh, and then see there was one. It was uh, uh, I, I'm gonna have to re I'm gonna have to look them up again because I actually I think I've got them. No, I, I don't think I did save them here. Darn. Well, anyway, these things happen. Yeah, <laughs> had to come at another time. Yep. But yeah, I like I like that. I like good. what he did. I liked what he did with and the character. And another the, thing was, it's got a very Monty Um feel to the the fight mm -hmm. choreography. I think so too. Oh, and it's sort of hard to it's sort of hard to describe what that feel is, but it's it's pretty close. Yeah, I like it. I I think so too. Yeah. I I mean to try and to try and emulate Monty's fight. You know the fighting styles and mm -hmm. Monty's uh. Uh, I'm just looking at uh, Typically, I've like uh, from my impression of when you have like in like Ruby style stuff, when the lead character is going up against a bunch of bad guys, yeah, that all kind of have the same gimmick. Typically, uh, most of the fights, you know, your lead characters always have 
uh, a lot of finesse to them, so they don't look like they're exerting themselves. They always pr- they show yeah. a lot of control constantly. It, yeah, it looks uh, pretty, pretty. You know, they don't ever like they don't ever get panicked or rushed. Um, yep, yep, yep. Even I mean, regardless of fighting style, because I mean, like <clears throat> you know, Sun kind of has like uh, you know he has that really big journey into the West feel like that monkey mm-hmm. style kung fu. Yeah, yeah. Um, so the styles look the same, but the overall attitude seems to be similar. Where uh, everybody's pretty calm, cool, and collected about it mm-hmm, um, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. until they run into like the big bad, and then yeah. when things start to kind of fall apart. But generally, like against like larger forces of like generic of bad the guys, grunts, they yeah. they do have that. Like they're just really slick about everything. Yeah, like um, uh, Yang's trailer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know she's fighting yeah. all of Junior's. Goons. And it's honestly, she's just like more so having fun with it than yeah, anything. Yeah, and then the the two girls come out and mm-hmm. it's just like, oh well, now this is interesting. Yeah, now it's a fight. Yeah, now it's a, you know, now it's a rumble. Yeah. So, and that was that was a fun that that was a fun trailer, and they touched on it in the uh, in the in the series actually. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And when she went yeah, back, to she Junior's went back club. to talk to Junior. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and which I sort of hope we see more of Junior because. Jack. Yeah, well, I mean, because Jack, and also because, you know, it's sort of interesting to be able to to call on the uh, sort of the crime boss kind of character. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, it's like, all right, what have you heard? And it's like, look, just just don't wreck my bar again. Mm-hmm. Just don't, uh, please. Look, I'm trying to be a legitimate businessman here. I'm like, no, you're not. What are you talking about? I think it's a uh, it's a fun thing. It's like, can I just get props for trying? Yeah. Can I get props for trying? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I could see that. Yeah. Uh all right. So once again, guys, this was the fan made charcoal trailer by Mark Jang. Mm-hmm. Uh check out his channel, guys. He's got uh he's got uh two others on there. He's got which, Silver and Viridian, I think which after we will... seeing these we have to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah, absolutely. One hundred percent. So if you want to check those out, guys, uh feel free to check out his channel, subscribe. Uh and also, um, hey, uh if you liked what you've seen here. Uh, don't forget to uh, like and subscribe as well. Don't forget to check the description for all of our various other endeavors. And, uh, yeah, that's going to do it. Mm-hmm. For uh, the Renegades here, this is Nate. I'm Ben. Micah. And we will see you all later. Peace out. Peace out.